All right, Nathan here chime K5L. I have bells both three and four. They're both straight. This one I had it shimmed, and this one is just a straight bell I got from Luke Jackson quite a few years ago. You can see that all these, all of them except for the number three, is all wide font. This one's is a 90s bell, which just got in there, which is now font. So I'm, I'm going to be doing two tests with these. One of them is with all stainless steel diaphragms, and then with the second test, I'm going to put these new diaphragms, which are brunoleum copper to be exact, and they're exact same dimensions as the stainless steel ones. So let's see how this one sounds. All right, K5L at 115 psi. Gonna have a little multimeter going on here. Press max. And then we'll see how loud this thing really is. Here we go. Alright, apparently so far that was the loudest one. You can see this one we got 118.6 de decibels. So, so now I'm going to switch out the stainless steel diaphragms with the brunoleum copper ones. Beryllium copper diaphragms are currently in the K5L now. Let's zoom out. Alright. So, the beryllium copper diaphragms are currently in the K5L now. Here is the old diaphragms. Yeah, somewhere. But anyhow, don't need them right now. So, this is going to be the first take on the beryllium copper diaphragms. And I'm going to have a decibel meter to see how we do. Uh, for all my tests, I've been running on DBA. That's what I've been doing for, the, for all the other tests. So now I'm going to put it on max. And there we go. I'm going to set you right at the same exact place I put you before. And let's... Give this thing a test run. Here we go.
So, zoom at, zoom you guys out. All right. So we got 116.8 decibels. I forgot what the other number was, but but we'll I'll crunch the numbers up and we'll see how they come out. So hopefully it sounds good. Thanks for watching.